iOS 11 information shows us that the iPhone 8 might work without a home button. LG announces the new LG V30, and U.S. carriers are all backing it up. And get ready to buy one, get one free deals for the Galaxy Note 8. I'm Jaime Rivera, reporting from IFA 2017 here at Showstoppers. And yeah, it's funny that we've been reporting on rumors of a phone that we've had for more than a week. But this is Pocket Out Daily. The official news today begin with deals. Believe it or not, the Galaxy Note 8 is not out yet, and there are already buy one, get one free deals that are being rumored for T-Mobile. Apparently, as of tomorrow, you will be able to order the Galaxy Note 8 and get another one, or in that case, get a Galaxy S8 or S8 Plus as well. I think that if the deal is through and it does happen, yeah, this is extremely compelling. And for those of you affected by the reason scam and problems about the essential phone and the fact that people got emails asking them for personal information and that personal information was actually spread along with everybody else in the email, Andy Rubin, the company's CEO, just came on record and apologized for this. The essential phone has been marred by a couple of things and it has nothing to do with the quality of the product. The phone is great. Not everything about the phone is great and it's the reason why we've held off to do this review. Uh, we'll explain definitely once the review goes live, but yeah, hopefully whatever scandal has happened will get fixed. Hopefully you get your hands on the phone soon. Now this is a very interesting development. Believe it or not, we weren't expecting to see anything from Palm, but remember TCL acquired the brand recently and the company is apparently teasing that they will do something with the brand as of next year. Now what exactly is going to happen with the brand is really hard to tell. It could just be that the company will figure out a way to add this product into certain demographic tiers. Palm is a productivity brand from many years ago. So hopefully that will be the spectrum along with BlackBerry it's going to be a very interesting portfolio. Now let's talk about iOS 11 since we just talked about Palm. We've got some interesting leaks from iOS 11 that show us that there are gestures designed for the iPhone 8 that will allow you to go home, very similar to what you currently do with iPads with iOS 11. So apparently certain swipes will allow you to be able to access certain parts of the user interface, which pretty much reminds us of WebOS in the glory days. So yeah, this is gonna be rather interesting if it ends up happening. And finally, the very interesting news today have to do with the LG V30, probably one of the hottest phones announced at EVA 2017. And yes, we've had the phone for more than a week. I can tell you this much, you've seen my Instagram photos, this phone is really good. Definitely watch our hands-on videos. The complexity of what this phone brings is so vast that we had to do a couple of videos because we just couldn't do it justice in three or four minutes. So yeah, watch all of our coverage of the V30 and we would love to know in the comments down below, what do you think of the V30? Do you think that this is a great phone or not? In my case, as I mentioned in my hands-on video, I think this phone is in a class of its own for creators. Definitely a good way to start if you want to get into the YouTube business and you haven't started. So yeah, leave us a comment down below. We'd love to know your opinion. Friends, you know the way it goes. If you want to get the news earlier before the video is filmed, follow us on pocketnow.com and subscribe to our channel as well for more videos like this one. You can also follow me on Twitter, Jaime underscore Rivera, on Instagram at Jaime Rivera. Please give this video a thumbs up if you like what you saw. I am Jaime Rivera. Thanks so much for watching. We'll see you tomorrow, hopefully 9 p.m. Eastern.